Hello, everybody. Fuck Welcome you. back to the fuck you, Z Man. <laughs> leave that in at the end is like a blooper. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of the Unturned Podcast. I'm your host, Kukui Charles, and we're joined once again by the Night Rider, Lore, Trading Games. Hello, Z Man, ten sixty four, and we have a special guest today, um, Spabby. Yeah. This is the fucking person... mic fell off and disconnected. <laughs> Thank God. Uh, was, that cool. loud? was that no. loud? Everybody, this is very impromptu because we had to interview this person now because of scheduling. Shut and the fuck up. This is the person you can blame for Easter Island. Please Shut direct all up. your hate you in the comments for, towards like, him. Things, not just Easter Island, but yeah, I suppose that. Yeah, I hate shotting people. Holy we're literally shit, recording. Tank. We're literally recording right after the third episode was released, like the next day. So no one fucking. Yeah. Oh, anything, yeah. if I meant to get back happens, on, so that was kind of nice. Thank you for if landing. Penine makes get this video on again. Me, then uh, we can't respond. So if anything happens in like the amount of time <laughs> that's like been around, uh, it's just because of that we're probably gonna. I don't know what episode it's gonna be. I honestly don't know. Holy All right, hold shit, on. I'm gonna so redo my intro. Game. I'm gonna redo my intro since my mic just. I'm goes. just too good. I'm gonna redo my intro since my no, mic you, just. No, you're not, no, man. It's already started. Right. I only have one spot. All right, all right. I missed. Up. You, okay, Z Man, man has had his schizophrenic break. Uh, first question. <sighs> all right, for wait, no, can I ask no, no, a no, question? No, no. There's no questions. What is this? An interview? This is a podcast. It's, it's a podcast. All right, so it's still an interview. Uh, conversation uh, topic. Spevy, what's your opinion on uh, P9 faking his base raids? Um, I really couldn't give a shit. It's entertainment. Fair. What do you guys think? Uh, why do you keep saying that? Look, this is this a ploy. This is a ploy. Because if I get him mad enough, he'll talk about it on his stream, and we'll get more views on the podcast. <laughs> why would you want this though? Because <laughs> I want I want you to get more views, Charles. Okay. This is your show. You keep bringing up like specifically that he does fake raids. It's just like, <laughs> to the point where Dude, I literally I just, we can't go an episode without mentioning P9. It's impossible. No, I just want to go. I just like mentioning that his raids are fake, man. He's a bit of a baka, a little sussy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> all right, I'll, I'll um, give you right, like we're now, long my my question for Spebby. Huh? Balls. What? Why? Yeah, I I like balls. I like them in my mouth. What? I like to what? Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Hey. Yo? Well, nothing wrong with that, but still. Okay, uh, I think we should give a little bit of like information about Spevy to like the general um, yeah. audience. Like, Probably. like, what do you do, Spevy? What, what would you say that uh, you do? I'm a fucking goblin. Uh, I sit in my corner and I make things. I I used to be like kind of uh, central-ish in the community. I'd say around like Athens' release to um, a little while after. Gang goes like in, like after Easter Island released, I kind of like phase out of the community because like I'm done. Dango. That was my thought process, and then I got involved with another map project, and I'm here two years later. Uh, I'm still working on it. Um, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. I thought it'd be gone by now. Can't get rid of me, I guess. I'm like a parasite. You always come back. Um, you would say. Yeah, yeah, kind of. Like, oh. like what William Afton said, at the, like in the um, die. ultimate custom night, actually, like when, <laughs> when you get jump scared by Afton, and he's like, "I always come back." That's like what, what I'm doing right now. Okay, I wait. Question, question, question for you, Scotty. Can, can I say this real quick? Question, before really, you go to the next on. episode, not next huh? episode. Question. Yeah, we're ending. Yeah, the well, are you a fan of FNAF at Freddy's? FNAF at Freddy's, as they yes. say in the yes. hood. Um, yeah. This is the part where people start clicking off the what's podcast. Your, what's your? What's your? Yeah. No, I'm trying. No, that's. No, this just sucks. Spoke, All right, right, I gotta. Re I gotta re-rail. All right, so um. No, no, FNAF's pretty rad. Yeah, this is the rad. unturned podcast, not the FNAF podcast. I was in a sack. I was in space, podcast. specifically off of what Spevy said. Is literally, I feel like the majority of people, like not majority, but people that were involved in the community, don't really leave. They're like always there in some form. I've been here for five years. Uh, no, I think uh, Harvest left. He's gone. That they one guy really that made leave. the World <laughs> War II know, um, like, mods is these gone. These days, don't even know who Harvest is. Or, like, yeah, wait, do you yeah, I don't know who Like, if you, you leave, if you, no, I mean, like, in this... like, do Battlefield 5 type beat, you know? What is it, like, Corvid Knight? What was it? Is that, was that his name? I forget. 
Corvid. I don't know. He's gone. Um, I guess Hold Baker, kinda. Not really. I don't I mean, know. They, like, they all have. <laughs> fucking Zeman just changed his profile picture midway. What's Bro. wrong with you? There. It's because I for I wanted it back to the my actual thing. To your, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean, you like, can't I, you can't be the knight anymore because I'm the knight rider. You know. No, I'm you're the knight, knight, dude. I was the knight no, before you. Riding. No, who's riding? Yeah, but you don't have knight in your name. Lord, so. Okay. My so emblem I is a helmet. Nighty boy, nighty, nighty rider. I'm a better knight than you. Yes. You're just following a trail that's already been blazed. I, I don't know what that means, but tell me your inspirations behind the lore of Easter Island. Uh, oh my god, I, this fucking guy in the lore, dude. Tired. I was really fucking tired, and I googled it, and then I saw, like, oh, by the way, uh, they he raised, um, he, uh, make Make Make, raised the island of a fucking lever or some shit, and I, uh, what? Hmm? What? I, I, I think he used, like, a car jack on the island, apparently. Like, this is canonical. And very, then, very schizo, very schizo. I, dude, I, like I, I don't, like, Polynesian, like, mythology is insane. Honestly, though, like, I know. How, uh, oh, the, Polynesia. I don't, I don't remember his name, the dude from Moana, he used his fishing hook Maui? to, uh, ra yeah, Maui, he used his fishing hook to raise New Zealand out of the sea. Yeah. Like, no, I think a lot of the islands have, like, a lot of the very island-specific ones, uh, well, I mean, they're all island, but a lot of them have, like, mythos like that, where, hey, the island came because um, some fucking god pulled it out of the ocean or something, which I think, I don't know, like, Make Make is, like, just an iteration of another god, you know, from what I hear. I forget. Hmm. It's been a while since I've stuck my head on that. There's, like, very little, though, that you can, like, find online. That's what and makes it so cool. It's obscure. I wanted to go to Easter Island to, like, talk to people. Uh, and then the world shut down. Wait, where's Easter Island located? Bro, that's dedication to your map, though. Oh, I don't like, have actually going, going there. there. Uh -huh. uh, Easter Island, it's... In it's technically a part of Chile, but it's like a, like a thousand miles off the coast. It's like I could point to it on a map because I'm a fucking git, but I uh, mm -hmm. yeah, it's 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 somewhere. It's yeah, my point. No, I know that. So why is it so bad? No, <laughs> why is the map bad? Uh, I haven't even played it, so I don't map. know if it's bad or not. Isn't it? Isn't it the map with like? That somebody on Earth said that like has all the compound objects. No, that's Hawaii, Hawaii bro. That's Hawaii. Hawaii. Yeah. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm sorry. Hawaii. They they look the exact same. <laughs> oh, oh, bro. Hey, um, that's just mean. Easter Hawaii. Island's what Hawaii wishes it was. It's Hawaii too. Yeah, that's fine. That, I mean, that was kind of the goal. Just make a better Hawaii. Because I like Hawaii. You um, liked like burning your eyes when you play Hawaii. Uh, I didn't mind. I didn't mind the grass that much. It's a bit quirky. I think but it could be better. <laughs> it's a bit jarring to go from. I mean, Washington it does make the map stand out. You know, it's not yeah. just m more green grass. It's it's interesting, but I mean, the fact that it happened because James made his monitor piss colored and then no one pointed it out is um, a bit concerning. That's hilarious. I, I yeah, it's also like, some dumbass shit. See, man, that's didn't you make a video on like why like? mods too much or like uh hawaii's bad or something i made a video about the problems with the map correct okay and then like yeah and then you had somebody on earth explain the compound thing i remember seeing that and i was like i disagree with that point because like why compound objects are actually bad uh depends so it fucking lags the game uh, it's just a fact i don't i don't think as much as some people think so well, I mean, if you're running a fucking potato, oh, like 90% of the unturned Wait, community. You don't think as much as some people think. <laughs> I run that explains a lot. That explains a lot. Forward rendering the whole ass time on low settings. Um, Look, man. No, I, you got, I, like, a supercomputer. I don't got a you make maps. But I don't got a supercomputer. Um, you don't? It takes me 30 minutes to boot California. See? Um, yikes. Sitting there loading. Bro, Hawaii laggy as shit. That yeah. is bright as fuck. I don't okay. understand what they did. My, my issue... Okay, I think compound objects, they're fine when used sparingly, but Hawaii abused them. The entire location... That's a, literally what SOE said. The entire location of monoliths is egregious, but, like, the... 
the construction site by the safe zone's fine, but then like uh, th there's a lot of issues and. As well as the boulder caves, uh, they should have had their own things. That's what somebody in there said. I think a lot of people really go on a, a hate train on compound objects if they exist. But yeah, Hawaii abused them, and that's the problem there. But Facts. I don't think them. Wait, wait. Them bad. wait, wait, wait. Uh, was it the entire like point that somebody on Earth was saying is that it was against the the curation? Yeah, it's the against rules? the rules. Literally against the rules. Well, yeah. So wait, if you uh, spam. A bunch of compound objects, does it cause performance issues? Uh, it yes. depends, I think, because the, the issue... I think, honestly, colliders is more of a concern than than meshes. Because I'm pretty sure the Hawaii beam objects were using, using mesh colliders instead of box colliders. And the thing with colliders uh, is that a box collider is a lot more simple for the computer to process than a mesh collider. Because the mesh colliders use the vertex information instead of the... Um, Instead of just a few values, so box glass. No. I know, like that means nothing to any of you, but um, to the audience to that's audience. nerds, uh, you understand. Yeah, no, the pay I don't attention know English. Is, like they're important. Uh, they they the performance. <laughs> I don't know. I I just feel like uh, I guess I'm just on the performance idea. Is like I mean, on terms of free game, and the majority of people, I mean, like play on like. They got like fucking shitter. Yeah, they got shitter. Computers. The yeah, issue, got shitter I think, computers. is that unturned optimization is dog shit because... Thank you. Finally, Nelson, someone mm -hmm, said it. Mm -hmm. Okay, Nelson made a pretty fundamental mistake early on. Mm -hmm. Made So all the maps are technically the same map. Um, and what? what the game does what? is that it just loads a scene, a Unity scene, and then it just reconstructs the map at runtime using a bunch of, like... JSON files and data files. Is the and map actually a real thing? Like you're able to go on it? What? The what? map that you're referring to? Because there's a you know there's a second map under Hawaii. What? What? It's what? like a second map under. Hawaii. You're just you're a conspiracy. Charles, theorist. your sick brain is like making you stupid again. No, Dude. I remember this because I was making fun of um yeah. Make us tell send the screenshot. I don't I don't that. have it, but I just remember making fun of um yeah because he was talking smack, and I was like, bro, you guys have like Spuffy. a second map under your map. Oh, are you talking about like the cave? Oh, was that Greece? I don't know. I think it might have been Greece. You're a schizo. But I mean, I remember making fun of um yeah. That's all I remember. You're schizophrenic. <laughs> No, okay, just the way that Unturned loads its scenes makes it so, like, any of, like, the occlusion calling and stuff is just off the table. Mm -hmm. uh, the game is fucking poorly optimized to shit. Yeah, um, I think that's, like, I, I kind of just wish Nelson would implement multi-scene stuff, like, but the issue with that is that you'd have to remake, like, every... Like every map, and like he's not gonna and, do that. So yeah, it's like it's too far at this point. Um, Unless you could import the maps, is that a thing? Well, the issue, the benefits of it would be that you could have like you could bake shit, but like you could bake light maps and you could bake um, other optimization techniques. But the issue with that is that um, you'd have to do that individually every time someone loads the map unless the person who made the map updates the map in which case i don't know i guess you could do it if only some maps had like if, if it was like a a thing that had to be supported by maps so you could still have the legacy way of working i don't know uh i would imagine it it's a nightmare i have a lot of sympathy for nelson because a while back i refactored one of my games it was a really it's a really small game but like it was a bitch and it took months and this is a small ass little tiny platformer and refactoring it took months and it's still not done it's still buggy as hell i can only imagine that refactoring something like unturned would be a nightmare well yeah because didn't nelson claim or did it's like unturned as if it is right now is like it was like very um it was sped up the production of it so everything's like pretty hard coded. Um, yeah, I mean, like what you're aiming for as a programmer is that like reusability, at least of object oriented. You're aiming mm -hmm. to make a system and then be able to reuse it somewhere else and be able to modify it without it breaking shit. And yeah, from my understanding, the way Unturned is is if you modify anything, it's going to have a cascading effect. 
So that's what makes it really difficult to modify shit. So, Bebby, why don't you just do it? I mean, you've told me before that you've just fixed people's maps and then sent it to them because you got sick of it. Uh, I did that with Belgium and only Belgium, and I mm. I fixed uh, the castle on Belgium because I felt like it was going to fall over because it had no back piece. And I told them I hated it, and they're like, but it has a foundation. I'm like, I don't care. It looks like shit. I'm doing it. And then I data mined it, and I fixed it. I'm like, have it. This is actual Chad energy. Um, many, uh, and also of Rio. Rio was stuck in development hell, and I told them, I am joining this team. I am finishing your fucking map for you. No. Just so it releases. Uh, so I did. You just I, finished I, some maps for them. Not well. I I motivated them to do it, and then I I did the speed trees for it. Um. What are speed? Oh yeah, those things. Yeah. I think yeah. I think mm -hmm. those ones were actually all right because they kind of they match their legacy models a lot more. I mm -hmm. spent a lot of time trying to make sure they match. Yeah. Oh God. Whenever I would look, sometimes I Google like Easter Island Unturned because I want to see what people say about it. And it's always that article that pops up, or something like that. Yes. Oh yeah, I posted an article in the chat where it says many on East Arm Island prefer to leave stones unturned. <laughs> I found that, and I thought it was funny. And I, I is this it. an unturned reference? I think it when is. When you look up unturned, half of the results are stuff like stone saying, unturned, like, no stone yeah, unturned, or like leave no stone. Yeah, leave no that, stone. Who unturned. even says no, leave no stone unturned anymore? Ready, was, we didn't know. We should, we should start saying that so it pops up whenever anyone says that. Uh, uh -huh. We should put in the tags mm -hmm. of the podcast. This, this episode will be yes. dream, no stones. And then hashtag so dream. <laughs> no, there's like, there's like, there's an image for that, actually. One second. Um, Leave no dicks unfucked. What? Yeah, what? yeah, you speak in my language. So, Spebby, tell us about Tukituri's shotgun. In detail. What are you talking? What are you guys even talking oh, about? I've been yeah, sitting I, here and I don't know what you're saying. I told Knight about cut content that Easter Island was going to get an update, and it might. Dude, no one gives a fuck about fucking lore. Can we talk about something you funny shut like? Up, yeah, no, I, I you talk about lore. I'll answer Knight's question. Okay, answer so, his question. And let's move um, on. Okay, but yeah, I agree with Z-Man. Uh, like, who cares Fine. about lore? Like, all right, whatever. <laughs> no one gives a shit. No one wants to talk about it in the podcast. You already made your Night fucking like twenty feeding, minute video. No, nope. tell um, me It's like feeding a gerbil crack. Wait, yeah, I know, dude. When you at the mouth, yo, like uh, nice just, we already get it. Night, I you like made a fifteen it. minute video about the entire lore. We don't need to talk about it anymore. Yo, yeah. Spebbers. I want to talk about more. Okay, Spebbers. Right. Like my Wait, okay, okay, Bebby. Bye. What? Uh, what do you think about Unturned, but like in VR? And I don't mean like, you know, like the actual building thing in VR, but I mean like fully immersive, like VR, like, you know, fully immersive the real VR. shit. Um, well, Unturned. you'd have to make the game from the ground up to support that, because okay. VR is a really different medium, and I think a lot Didn't, of people don't Isn't that already a thing? I just uh, said, Italy, oh, did that bit. Thing. I remember hearing about that back when it was around, and I thought it was really cool, and then it disappeared, and I thought it was like a fever dream, and it popped up again. Dilio <laughs> brought it back. Danaby had the file the whole time. He's been holding it like forever. Yeah. Yeah, know, did, uh, Danaby the, is an enigma. Uh, I don't know. Let me let me say something to night. Right Honestly, now. night. When we have Serrani yep. on in like in like the seven hundredth episode, then you can do like All the right. whole lore dumping. Okay. Uh, I don't think I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't think you're gonna get very far. But... The if we I, ever get Serrani on, which I I think we might in the sometime mm -hmm. in the future. Maybe. The whole episode is going to be me, Knight, and Serati talking about lore. Oh, yeah, this is going to no, be me. No, no, not me you, and Knight no, are going to be you. talking gonna about Five Nights at Freddy's. No, not Knight. No, Serati and me are going to be talking about Five Nights at Freddy's. That's I play I'm going to kill myself. Yeah, well, you're not a real FNAF or dude. What? what? How, how could dare you? Dude, what's the name of the bear? What's the name of the bear? Which bear? Exactly. Bear, he doesn't the even bear. know. There's five, know. There's Golden Freddy. What's the name of the bear from Five Nights at Freddy's? He doesn't even know. Freddy, false fan, false fan, false fan. Get out of here! Can we shut the fuck up? I hate Five Nights at Freddy's. Dude, I hate I you. Say that that game fucking is overrated as shit. Guys, Dude, I want y'all to realize that nobody's scary, watching man. this podcast right now. Nobody is yes, watching it's anymore. Yes, because boring as fuck. All right, P nine fake raids. What the you fuck keep is this? Z man, this isn't a tabloid <laughs> podcast. <laughs> yeah, it is now. All right, so uh, I think it's real. Well, of course it's real. How like? Yeah, the, the, the base raids are real, yeah. No, I, I, I could care less if he gets his shit from I, want, I just want him to get mad and, like, go on a tirade on Twitter about me. 
Just well, so that we can this, get views on the don't podcast. Don't pull me into it, because I still want to join his Call of Duty thing. Where I'm going to totally laggedy. say that you are a co-conspirator. Conspiracy. I will, if he DMs me, I will name you by name Trident Game. Oh, he, yeah, uh, no, 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 no. He was like, I made that video and he went on about it for six hours on his fucking stream. Wait, isn't that when you joined him and then started talking? Or well, I joined like... him and then like, I was trying to argue with him and then I just started fucking just agreeing with anything he said just because I was bored. Like, I just wanted to be done. And then I started trolling and then eventually it ended by me saying, wait, hold on, I gotta go take a piss. I'm gonna go piss. And then he just left he the call because he got so mad. This, this was P9 in that stream. Holy Scabby, shit, Roger do you know about this pods, lore? Dude. Holy, look at this, Kakui. Shut the oh fuck up. Look at it. Roderick actually has Stop posting vids, they can't Stop. see it on the podcast because Charles won't edit the podcast. I don't get, I don't get any audio I'm to, talking specifically yeah, to Kakui. Yeah, because he's fucking lazy. Roderick has AirPods. Roderick has AirPods. Roderick has AirPods. I'm gonna lick your taint. Kukui, stop Yo! crying. Yo! Alright, so California. Can we talk about California, Matt? Okay, yeah, okay, honestly, okay, honestly California, California was nice. Man. That bridge area Did was you make nice. that map? Who made that nice map? Dream. I have uh, good memories on California. Huh? Who made that? Clue and Renaxon. Were you working on it? No. Not the aren't, you, aren't you working on something? Yeah, or are I'm we not allowed to mention it? it? But, but the thing is, what was it? So I, I don't know. I, I would love to talk about it, and I'm very tempted. But at the same time, I don't want to get people hyped for something that is really uncertain. All right, everybody, do not get your hopes up. I repeat, this is don't a get your hopes you up. This is all speculative stuff clip. that we might you have talk five about. Five seconds to leave, so you don't get your hopes up. See that the podcast <laughs> temporarily. Who's gonna get their hopes up? God, I hate the SDG forms. Oh, yeah, can we talk yeah. about that? Can we talk about this dumbass Wait, post that I saw I, in there? SDG forms is like Reddit, but but right? worse. It was, okay, like mm -hmm, it was mm -hmm. made to like circumvent the Reddit because like the Reddit was toxic, and then it's even more toxic. Any any that seems to be like the any like actual public discussion page that's hosted by any like uh, it's a closed SDG garden. Member it's, garden. it's like it's just a containment facility. I brought this up in a different episode. But it's a containment facility of the worst people in the community. <laughs> it's May I talk about a post that I saw that was really bad? Sure. Oh, sure. Mm -hmm. Alright, so it's, you might, you, you, some of you might have saw this. It was fucking by <laughs> this fucker named Fluffy Pancakes. Fluffy Pancakes. Not familiar. He was just bitching about how there's no unturned content, like animation shit oh. or whatever the fuck. Like, there's no unturned content. Um... Like, and I don't know what an FBX map downloader is, but he was complaining about that. What? He's I mean, like, He was complaining about no, like, unturned animations, even though all the game's models are available, okay. even though I guess he doesn't know about Deer Right TV. Yeah. Oh, wait, 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 uh, wait didn't you, Dog, like, go and troll him a little bit? Yeah, I trolled him as well, like, ratioed, honestly. Honestly <laughs> ratioed. This guy is, like, cringe, and then he would reply... With to everything with like the like the emoji with the teeth. Oh <laughs> no! Uh, fluff, actually, fluffy pancakes is in my. Uh, what was it? Is in, in my? I think he, he made a He's video. in my Discord. He's a he's, he's actually complaining. Nice dude. The guy he's a, he's a nice guy once you get to know him. He's complaining about like no unturned animation, but his animations are so bad. I've seen them. It's like the character moves a little, and he just moves a PNG of a mouth on the face. Like it's not an actual animation. He's just moving something. Very cringe. That counts. That counts. Hey, you guys want to see something? <laughs> see sure. what? Hold up. Before we leave the SCG forums meme, like I think was honestly... that a real image they showed? Photoshop. <laughs> no, it wasn't. But that's a real Nelson screenshot there. <laughs> Bro, that's a real that's, image they showed. That's some pretty good. I know that's, that's That'd be really sad. That, that would be hilarious, actually. Yeah, we really should talk sad. about unturned console. Worst console. Okay, console. Uh, it's not. It's mad. I don't really like the trees are trippy, Waste of my thirty dollars when I got it. Like Elver update actually like irreversibly break that game and they've just not picked it they're enough. fucking they ruined it dude the unturned console had such the potential to like kind of like revive the game a bit by introducing new people but they fucking butchered it because okay. they made romanians do it here's here's the thing 
Uh, Final oh. Five games. I don't fucking know what. Bullshit. This I think Final Z-Man. Five is a joke. Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna a, fucking cry. Let, let me let me get into this. I remember okay. specifically like uh, the people. There was two companies originally because I remember we, I think we just I discussed it with somebody else. But mm-hmm. uh, it was Final Five and Game uh, and Fun Labs or whatever the fuck their name is. And they were Fun Lab was yeah. a Romanian based company. But what happened was is that Fun I think Fun Labs either got dropped or left the entire project alone. So the whole entire thing has been left to Five Hundred Five. Five Hundred Five suck has fucking a, like since the beginning. Since uh, okay, I should have known. I should have known that this would have been a fucking train wreck the moment that we saw the fucking trailer when it got. I leaked. already knew it was a train when wreck. We, I already got. Made, I made a video. Everyone should. Have, everyone should have known. Like immediately, that it was gonna fail. Yeah, uh, the, trailer, the trailer was like yeah. a mobile game trailer. Trailer? I don't know. Uh, I've seen some pretty bad trailers for some pretty good games. I don't know. But I, I think Sir Addy needs to make another one of those advanced, like pseudo documentary style videos, but about Unturned Console Edition. Uh, maybe I don't know. I mean, it depends on what they do. Like, okay, I hate Five Hundred Five because they did this to Terraria as well, like the console port. Of like when one point two Terraria came out, like it was unplayable. It like straight up like it, you would corrupt worlds. It would be broken. It would stop loading after a while. Like you would play it, and you would put like an item in a chest, and it would convert it to the like the number of the item you put in the chest to an ID of another item, oh. and then when you like reloaded the world, and then after a while, the world got so irreversibly broken that the entire game just wouldn't load. Wow, that they fucking suck. How do you mess up that bad? <laughs> they mm. suck. Five hundred five. Like honestly, fuck five hundred five. Let's, let's also, they should have never made on. So Toronto the trailer was bad, but there was still a little bit of hope for the actual game. But the fucking the game price tag was more expensive than fucking Minecraft. I think, or yeah, I fucking launched. It was more expensive than Minecraft, and let alone you know fucking Unturned's free. Hunter is a free game on Steam, and it cost more mm-hmm. than fucking Minecraft on launch on fucking because console. Because they wouldn't, they wouldn't make a profit if they didn't. It like, could have made at least five dollars. Like, you still see kids in I YouTube know. comments on the subreddit and forums. It's like, so when's Unturned Console gonna get the next update? Is Kuwait ever gonna come to console, guys? It's not. Uh, it's Shut up. Like, like, no, I'm not right, Oliver, they're probably not gonna do any sort of. That should they should have never um, made um, Unturned console they should have never made it i made a video as soon as that trailer came out um and i got some big shit oh by the way i've this was another uh this is a throwback to the last podcast when i talked about how i called spammel uh apparently i fucked up some shit when i leaked the trailer a day before the release yeah like spammel had something planned or somebody had something planned with 505 to do like a thing an event and they canceled it because like of the um, the um blockade or whatever the fuck it's called what's it what's a blockade called what's a blockade called a blockade it's like you know how north korea they can't trade with anyone embargoed the embargo that's what that's what mr spam was calling it the embargo Mm -hmm. Um, they fucking had it. The they had it embargoed because it wasn't out yet. But I leaked it, and then that ruined some shit, which is kind of funny. And then like yeah, I got funny. age restricted on that video, so then I made a video <laughs> talking about why the console would fail, why it would fail, and I was right. And I remember cool. people clowning on me for it, like, was- "Oh, console won't fail," even though I was fucking right the whole time. Okay, it's actually, a joke. Uh, can you refresh me? Like, what what were you right about? I said it would fail. Well, yeah. I was like, right. For what reason? Um, I gotta go back to the vid. It was multiple reasons. Um, uh, I mentioned how it was fucking like, like I mentioned how it was overpriced. Mm-hmm. I think I mentioned reason how one, it's bad. <laughs> and how it wasn't refined enough to actually. I mentioned how the much. trailer like just fucking just fucked up the release. Like, imagine if it was a better trailer. There would probably have been more people that would have. Like seen it. Yeah, or more I think new many people, people said Toothy Deerai or Doug could do a better job at the animation. They should have hired him, honestly. But, but I don't get about the whole fucking trailer thing. It didn't even need to be the animation. It could have been just fucking gameplay of Unturned, like the actual trailer for Unturned. Yeah, the Unturned yeah. Trailer Maybe is they could have just good. used that. Maybe they yeah, could have just used the same that. Name. Also, yeah, why does the art style suck? Why does the art style for it suck? 
because they yeah, outsource. Wait, 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 they probably the outsource the trailer to some Chinese company that doesn't give a crap. No, I meant the fucking. And the game looks like shit. Why is the trees oh, yeah. fucked up? And why is everything that. round? Wait, Spabby, what were you gonna say? Um, I'm just saying that. I mean, they could have remade like. What's the? I think the Germany trailer is the best trailer. Like Unturns had. Um, for real. So I. I guess remake the the Germany trailer. I like think my personal right? favorite trailer is the Elver one. The Elver I one? really like that one. I don't have a favorite trailer. Uh, I th I think the Dango one was like my favorite one is the Dango one. Um, but actually, no, the Athens one is really good. The Athens. One oh yeah, one Athens. Athens. I like the Athens. The trailer. music choice on Athens was so good, and I was like, and I told Dan, "All right, Dan, where'd you get this from?" And he told me the site, and that's like where all the unturned like trailer music's taken from and i spent like days upon days sh sifting through that trying to find something as good as athens for like the rio trailer and then um, did you work on rio yeah i did are you on the are you a part of the rio map team i'm credited in collaborators dude that map sucks uh yeah Bro, I, and then they I tried really, to do a revamp really didn't and they think canceled Rio it. Rio was that bad. So I didn't do your think own it was thing. That it's bad. fucking liked, shit, Knight Rider. I liked the well, no, <laughs> it's, I liked the end Easter egg. I liked the end Easter egg for it. Okay, okay the, rest, the rest sucks, of the map. Dude. No, the rest of the map was pretty forgettable. I'll admit it's that. But the shit. ending Easter egg, Z Man, will you shut up for five seconds? It's shit. I will. I will fight you. I'm a menace. I'll fight well. you. You're I'm not. A your pants you're not a good. menace. You're an annoyance. You're a pest. No, I'm a menace. You're a I'm pest. A menace. Rio, if it released when it was actually like supposed to release, I think people would think of it a lot more fondly because like it would have like released around like the Ireland era. Also, the trailer. Man, that's wasn't era like, sucked, that great. Like, let trailer. me find the Rio what trailer. What map is good, Z Man? What map is good? Don't I say I'm involved in the the trailer. We had to scramble for that trailer, like. Like it wasn't like it was like it was just rush. It was okay. It was four people working on it. Somebody on Earth was one of them, and he was flying the helicopter while he his internet connection was literally dying. It was like it was like he had like four hundred ping. God, uh, that's what's with people fucking up the game? They just make shit maps, and then there's a whole ge a version of Unturned that shit. To be honest, it's very I, laggy. Wait, I thought the scene <laughs> that. Started at zero zero eight with the music and the way they are panning that camera and it's that's, tilted. That's I thought that was really awful, effective, like, actually, <laughs> as like a eerie atmosphere. But then so you just crazy. pulled it up. And now that, and but then at zero fourteen, it's oh, really wait, laggy, yeah, and then the top of the actual stadium is okay. I think uh, yeah, water the I, water the water yeah. park area. It just like it it like who was in charge of like the cinematics? Frago. Did he not like? Did he have that? a decent PC or was yeah. it just? No, no. Frogo's PC was is worse than my, or was worse than mine at the time. I don't know what Frogo's up to these days. So no. Because the uh, problem is like the, there's like in the scene that you can just see like no shadows, shadows, no foliage, foliage. Okay. No so sun, anything like it that. Was, it was a lot better than what it could have been because I remember Float out recorded a trailer which was like 30 minutes of gameplay and mm -hmm. and he had a good computer at the time. He could run on Ultra, but like it was. <laughs> not good and frogo ended up doing the cinematics because no one like had an eye for it even though frogo had like the worst computer for it mm -hmm. so frogo was also going to do the easter island trailer but uh that that one was a lot more planned and if it we if we were able to finish it it probably would have been a pretty fun trailer uh we yeah. have like we uploaded like what we had of it like unlisted and like the um, and then the helicopter crashes. The helicopter, yeah, that was because <laughs> I think so actually got disconnected from the server. Spavi, uh, should make a... That is beautiful. Oh yeah, Spavi, you see like should a make a vid fucking, fucking shitting on Rio. Zeman, you're still among us right now. Why am I among us? Just he's a bit of, he's a bit of a spring trap right now. Legit, Spavi, it seems that like you work a lot with like other people on projects. Will you ever like uh, you go solo? Too. Well, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so I'm not a very good modeler. I'm decent at Unity, and I spend way too much time optimizing shit, and I, I, I'm a Unity rat, basically, and, and I can plan. So I work with Nolan a lot, um, the guy who made Candyland, worked on 
he also worked on Rio, but he gave up at the end. And he also worked on Belgium partly. He he fucking like the only reason why Belgium's at least passable is because Nolan was like fucking this is horrid. Um, say what you want about Belgium. What a lad. At least it's fucking functional. Like it's bad, it was, but like I did play with it. it was so much worse. I did play like that with a friend for like thirty minutes, and it was it wasn't bad. But it just felt like every unturned map. But that was yeah, just the boring. problem with all other maps before it's Elver. Not bad. It's just boring. I think no. I think a big problem was I remember like a day like one, I was able to fly with the tank on Belgium. Like yep. it was so bad. I forget. I forget how that happened. You go inside the the cockpit of the tank, uh, mm-hmm. like the driver's seat, and you're able just to go upwards. I have I a whole video on that. Something. So, like, day one, I remember Nelson fucked something up on Belgium, and he really fucked something up on Rio, because Rio's launch being, like, an optional curated map was, like, not communicated at all to the team, and then there was a severe bug where spawn tables wouldn't load correctly if the if something was, like, subscribed to while the game was already open, so people would go on to Rio, and they'd go into stores, and all they'd find was speed guns. And I, I like thought it was something on our end, so I manually redid every spawn table. But no, it was it was because Nelson like didn't update the spawn table system to refresh mm. when requested. Nelson two, dude, he'd be causing some trouble. Nelson two, fuck that guy. Nelson two. So Spabby, Nelson what can you what can you tell us about Candyland lore? Because Squide yeah. wasn't helpful with that. Uh, Candyland lore. Um, it's actually Colorado. I'm not like joking. like where Vermillion is. Yeah. Yo, Wait, is there Vermillion Easter egg in Candyland now? You uh, gotta you gotta like, put one in. Like one of the locations is like a couple of the locations are literally just named after cities in Colorado. Um, oh. I think the lore is that like some girl, like had a fucking vivid dream. And then, like, she turned the world into candy or something, and she crystallized herself into some fucking horror or something. I forget. Pyrovision. Like, Yo, that's like a that's like a I, Dark Souls story. I think there was like like the soul crystals were involved or something. I forget. I forgot. Uh, wait, I'm gonna go for a little bit. Uh, um, right. Trey, you you're leaving wow. every episode. Right? Right. Remember what I said about the darts, right? <laughs> Did not bring that up. What I said about the dark. Try, try like, to just left. Oh. No, try, try it. Why are you leaving what? like fucking mid, midway through the podcast? That's, the only so to help out Zipe with something. The only the only fucking time that we had you like fully on was during the first episode. Unless like more episodes have come out where Trident's actually in it, but I don't care. Shout out to Trident Games. Goodbye. I've not All watched right, any of these videos. There he goes. Fuck that guy honestly. off on his own adventure. I just, you know what, I wish, I hope him well. I hope him well. You know, he will, I hope that he finds a very fulfilling life in whatever he's doing. Um, I think, though, more more likely he's going to get in a car crash. Uh, Probably caused by you. Dude, I want to get a restraining order on that man. He cannot be within 50 meters of me. Can't get in a car crash if there's a restraining order. It's just, it's kind of rude. I'm going to be honest. I mean, like, what, what is Trident, like, like, what good is Trident done to me? Like, let's be honest. Like, come on. Yeah, good point. Good point. Like, real. Yeah. 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 I think Z-Man's, like, asleep right now. He's yeah, asleep. this is very impromptu. Nobody was prepared. No one was prepared. I'm and... not really sure what else to ask you, Bevy, because you're not really necessarily. I mean, you're like, I guess you could say that you're an OG. Well, the OGs. Are yeah, and you'll you, you'll yell at me if I ask you about lore. So I I started playing at like Fest of Russia. That's when I started playing. I remember I played 2.0, and I loaded in like by a lighthouse, and I said out loud, "This game is shit," and I stopped playing. I Bruh. remember. I remember when I like I had someone on my friends list. Way back when. And they had, like, the unturned zombie as their profile picture. And for some reason, that, like, enraged me. That gave me, like, (laughs) time away. It enraged me. (laughs) I played unturned in the first place. And then I didn't play it until, like, a few years later. Because, you know, I I didn't have a ton of money. 
uh because you know fucking dumb kid Mm -hmm. and i was like looking at free games and i was like oh unturned i'll play that and i did and i uh yeah and now you play unturned when it was off steam no uh no 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 i played it when it was on Steam. okay okay both times okay yeah, I played 2.0 and then I stopped playing it and then I played 3.0 around the release of Fest of Russia. I have a really, I have like a, a vague memory of like swimming in like a, in the frozen ocean in Fest of Russia. I remember spawning in the ocean, which isn't possible. So my brain fabricated that shit, but you never know. I remember. Unless it didn't. I, I don't think it did. Uh... Z man, you need to bring a soundboard for the podcast. Do not do that. Do not fucking give him that. You bring the vine thump. Do not give him that. Why would you? Why would you say that? Because we need sound effects. We do not we need, need like, sound effects. We need a little boing. Yeah. It's exactly. All of it. All of it. What are you talking about right now? Yeah. Z man, you need to use the soundboard for the podcast. Where the fuck did Trident go? Uh, Trident went to like smoke meth. He know. said something about talking to Zype. I don't know if that's true or not. Oh my god, this fucking guy is always out of the podcast halfway through. Yeah, that's why I said to him. The one who just came back. Me, At least he's in the call still. I'm still in the call. I went to get KFC. I'm back. <laughs> went to get this guy. This guy. Can we talk about something interesting? Like, what's yeah, like, um? Kind of fakes his base rates. Shut up. Yeah. Can we die? Not... Yeah. Dude. How about we talk about that? That's interesting. We're never yeah, getting Nels on the podcast. He's gonna be I hear this shit. shit. <laughs> I don't care at this point. Dude, yeah, I think Nelson, kinda... he obviously doesn't like like a lot of people in the community. I think we should let bygones be bygones. What do you think, Z Man? I think we should let bygones be bygones. Absolutely. Okay. Like we should yes. really like like be initiative like to you know kind of be toxic what? community. Kind of like that's never he gonna just happen. To, see, here's the thing with Nelson. Let me just speak some facts about this man. Facts about the. He seems that it seems he really is like very invested in it, like his um, public image. Oh yeah. And he seems very keen on keeping himself PG. And he, for some reason, fears that if he talks to someone, for example, me. Or I disagree um, with that statement. Something I don't know. Sp- oh, the only person I can think of is me, or someone. That's only that's anyone that's slightly edgy. That like he's like done for. Okay. That, like, that's that's I not act- true. That's not true. I we talking about. I Shut the it. fuck up. Let me let me just, <laughs> let me spit some facts, Charlie. It's not even facts. With literally, I Zoom. emailed them. Z- I emailed hold on, hold on. Nelson Sexton, and I'm he just said an observer that here. He I can't want to talk, talk to me. I can't talk any mess. Literally, with Nelson, I interviewed him. Literally, Zoom, Zoom B, talked to him. Yeah, twice I know. For an interview. Yeah, that's why it doesn't make He's sense. He's an R&P you, intervie- you interviewed him once with Sicily, sort of. Yeah, but I, I tried to get in a private call with him one time. I wanted to do an interview about 4.0. Bruh. And he and said no. Hundred. He said he wouldn't. He wasn't wanted to because like of my content. Probably because like, I start yeah. drama. But like, come on. Okay. No. No. All right. Z man. Like, I think like you kind of got to understand that the last thing Nelson wants is like to see like his name in a fucking news article and related to drama. That's like the last thing he wants right now. He just wants to be able to quietly make his games and make people happy. Yeah, and to be fair, I'm sure like I'd really be on the news. Last thing anybody there wants. There used to be an insider, like, if someone from Insider could get into the fucking Ontario community and start, like, writing news articles about how bad this community is, maybe really something. <laughs> it would, no, it would, it would, I would, dude, I am, like, seriously, I, I delete, well, I didn't delete my forms account, but I changed my name on it. I know, I don't I, I'm not gonna say the only, uh, I know somebody that deleted their whole entire presence on that platform. Yeah, that was Harvest. Well, Harvest was like, well, I'm done. No, let's, let's I'm not saying names. Because, because, I'm not saying names just because. Oh, the guy that tried to go dark? I'm literally not can saying names because of that reason. Can we talk about that for a second? So, this He's guy done. wants to be like business rep, you know, presentable, right? He doesn't want to talk to me or like people that are edgy. Yeah. And yet, he has an entire forum where most of the people on there are fucking like, they hate like anyone of color, gay people. Red trans, trans people, oh, Francis, you know, 
Classic. They're all like, yes. like they're fucking like, like how is that not a bad look? It's your forum. I mean, yeah, they're just people um, talking though. I mean, I don't, I don't really think that could be bounced back I to think, Nelson. I think. Well, it's his official forum, so he should. He should really clean it up. I've like talked to Molten about that before, and I think it's. I really like Molten, but he's really soft on people. I noticed that. Uh, but I mean, like, it's hard to be hard on people when a lot of them are like, when a lot of the edgy people on there were like friends. Like, I, I was so edgy on the forums, and like, I'm like, well, at the time I was friends. Hey, he's with back. Them. Oh my god, this <laughs> fucking. Clown. How tried him? Why? Just continue. Are you even on this show? Should we? Do we need to like the first is Trident, Trident, is Trident just like a guest host we have every now and then? Sometimes can we, like, does he just uh, show okay. up? Can we so both, for, like, okay, so for real, but can we like eject Trident? I think he's a little sussy. Yeah, we need to. <laughs> no, that's Kukui's show. Do 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 do. Okay, so I hate him on yeah, this. Yeah, there's reported uh i think like purple's a little sus i don't right know I, I don't think it would really i think if someone were to bring up like the forums is toxic i think anybody in rc would be like yeah there really should be something done about it um i think the main issue though with the forums for the longest time is that it's been a walled garden uh and it's really hostile to new people yeah, yeah i know it's shit like no like i remember for a while i tried to get a lot of new people on the forums and all of them got like bullied off or they got, or their opinions got like rejected. It's just a shit fucking platform because they all cir circle jerk each other, bro. It's annoying. Yeah, no, okay. The only way to fight toxicity is to be toxic yourself. Um, and that is <laughs> what people. <laughs> that's how I, that's what I know. That's possible because Pine Ridge, yeah. and even okay, Pine Ridge was like a walled garden within a walled garden because it's like like form regulars would get like voted into Pine Ridge, and I remember. <laughs> Frogo got banned. Nolan got banned. I, me and Ramlin left because we thought it was a shit show. And Pine Ridge was somehow better than the form. I don't know how, but it was still like bad. Speaking of speaking of Pine, this podcast episode is sponsored oh by. No. I'm blanking that out that weird. name. They they have not paid us. I'm literally gonna go back wow. in the audio. What's yeah, happening? blur it out. Yeah, blur that you're out. fucking annoying. Yeah, like, it's all your fault. Maybe we should. Thank it's you. all your fault. Why? I just want money. I don't care about <laughs> I want I don't... I'm not willing to sell my soul. Dirty. I'll never sell my soul. You'll never sell your soul. I promise. Same. I'm never. saying this right now. This is just a footnote in history that I'm leaving you here. So someone give you a billion dollars to sponsor. No, I promise. That's ridiculous. I will, never, I will never sell my soul. I will never change. All these fuckers can suck my had... dick. I'm gonna keep Are... doing what I do, and they could they can suck it. I don't give I mean, a fuck. Like, so, so you're saying if a billion dollars came by and said, "Hey, they no one thinks I'm too hosting. edgy." I don't give a shit. I'm not gonna change for no one. No, but like sponsor pine good game developer. For a don't really get. Don't you would really not take care it for his. You know, listen, try to, You got to think about this proportionally, right? If somebody gave you two billion dollars, no one's gonna give me two billion dollars. I mean, you don't know that anymore. Crappy like that hosting. So yeah, you're gonna do I'm it. I'm gonna do gonna, it. Gonna, no, and then you're gonna spend one million to have the site I... shut down. So like, <laughs> I just buy the company after. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and delete it. <laughs> yeah, buy the company, liquidate all its assets, and then like go on yeah. with your day. So yeah, that's a, you got to think about this pragmatically. You know, you can I will evil. never change. You can defeat the yes, evil you will. RP. It's, not, it's never. Brad's RP shit. Remember, like, is bleeding out still around? No, yeah. they got fucked no. over after the thanking in invasion happened. <laughs> what? The the what? Who invasion? After, after uh, a bunch of like shit was happening with the unturned netcode. There's a tweet on Nelson's Twitter from like 2017 saying a bunch of nefarious people got a hold of a certain exploit and like half the unturned player base got like couldn't play unturned. I remember this vividly. Thanos snap. And basically, all uh, the. Basically, what these guys were able to do, they were able to jump on servers and just click one button and send like millions of packets to uh, any server and just get them completely yeah. taken off offline. That right? sounds like an unturned. Yo, Z man, outside. you need to get a hold of that. We could shut down but Brad's then, for good. But literally, <laughs> but literally, what happened is that they they targeted all of bleeding out and then they got pissed off and they were like, you know what, we're not dealing with your shit anymore, and they disappeared. Like I remember bleeding out though. I remember like playing on bleeding out with a couple of people and we were all called Doug Soderstrom 
and we lived in the cave under the like Honol- what's the fucking stairs location called and it you was lived like, in a cave yeah we lived in a cave and we had a base there and there was like this like weird little hole notch that we like completely barricaded and it was like basically unrateable because of that um mm-hmm. and these these guys these like russian kids who couldn't he could barely speak english um they like got really pissed off because they like wandered in and we ambushed them and they like teleported back and used like the starter kit to try to kill us and then they were like guys they're hacking they're using discord (laughs) oh no that's so stupid (laughs) and and they're like they're using discord this is unfair and then they tried to like leak our location and they're like doug's under um monokai or something whatever what what What's the fucking Mordecai. Volcano? What's the volcano called? Mordecai. Mauna Kea. Mauna Kea. Mauna Kea. They're like, Doug's under Mauna Kea, but that's not where we were. And it was like, it's the funniest shit. Fuck plates. I hate plates. Yep. Mm. So let's talk about, I know something non-controversial we could talk about. What is y'all's opinion on this uh, unturned Ball trading Park? card game? What's your opinion on uh, P9 doing? and fake? Oh my race? fucking god, dude. I, I Z-Man, Z-Man. my opinion on you is dropping <laughs> oh, no, no, slowly no, but surely. Z-Man. Every time oh, we record an episode, mm. like, fake his raids, it's like it's really bad. Like I'm like I'm I'm fuming, I'm spitting, I'm coughing, I'm Z oh, Man. There's gotta be at least one fucking episode that you do not mention. No, P9. every episode until he <laughs> either tells me to stop or I get canceled. I'm gonna, I'm gonna figure out. Right. <laughs> What's up the P9 to mask? That thing fucking blows. It's overpriced. I don't give a okay, shit. It doesn't. Wait, it's like, it's like oh, it's two so bucks. Mad. No, we're it's not, not the worst it. thing in the I'm world. I'm gonna get mad if we things. talk about it anymore. Stop. There's talking. definitely worse things about the P9 mask. I believe. Trident, Trident, don't poke the bear. Let me say this. Don't, make, this is the don't only get thing. me started. This is the only thing I'm gonna say right now. Ages, I was trying to get like Christmas in July featured in Unturned, and like like the um for the like for a christmas update and we updated it for christmas and nelson actually added a bundle for us but he never featured the game like he or sorry he never featured the map like you can go onto the stockpile and buy like a fucking rambo outfit that's like oh. christmas in july but like yo way yo i'm gonna cop that right now where that's been a thing for years all right there was like, a I... thing planned as well just oh, left. My God. this cunt what the fuck He's gone again. Oh my. Whatever. All right, everyone. Trident Games lives at. What? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. So what's it called? Uh, I think it's called. Well, I mean, I remember. Um, what we called it like Self Esther Stallone or St- Stallone or some weird shit. But no, it, it, I think it got like renamed by Nelson to like, like it's like it's Guerrilla Warfare. That's it. Guerrilla Warfare. That's what he renamed it to. And there's like a bullet belt and shit. Oh, I think I might already have that. I didn't know that was for Christmas in July. Yeah. Christmas in July is my favorite map, by the way. Like, Well, you made it. Well, no, no, no. I mean, like, no. the maps I've made. Oh, okay. Um, I mean, it, it did look good. It's not that it looked good. It's just that it was a lot of stupid fun. Because so, uh, you, choose, cr- you chose where you spawned. I like Christmas it. in July lore? Christmas in July lore, um, the Polar Express broke down. Uh, actually, okay, there is lore. Um, <laughs> it's that, yes. so, uh, it's the typical Santa is a tyrant lore. Um, nice. And he went to, um, he went to Easter Island. Oh my vacation. god. <laughs> and <laughs> uh, Easter Island, an early version of Easter Island's in the Christmas in July trailer. But, mm-hmm. and I think there's, there's a note on Christmas, uh, on Easter Island saying that Nick will be back at the factory and Knight Rider like interpreted that as some weird shit. I think he interpreted that as like the Moai quarry. Yeah, the because that's what they called it in real life. The Rano Raraku Moai factory. That's what they call it in real life. Yeah, I don't know, yeah. I guess. But like no, it referred to Christmas in July. So like Santa was gone on summer vacation and the elves decided to celebrate summer, but that broke like an arcane spell. And oh. then they went insane and started trying to kill everyone. And then, like on full moons, the um the propaganda displays are replaced with um a grunt from doom running at you. I don't oh, remember why. The what? 
Oh yeah, the it's. Bro, can you set up a server for Christmas in July? I will advertise it, and then we can all like. I want to update that because it's it's a really fun map, and I'm and playtesting it was some of the most fun I ever had in Unturned. That was like so much fun, Um, and I want to update it again so it actually gets featured this time, so people actually Mm -hmm. play it. And then I will make a uh, Christmas in July uh, lore video for Chris for a Christmas special or something. I think I think it was briefly on a server chain because like, what is it? Lime, yeah, Lime server hosting. He did like some deathmatch servers with Dango and Christmas in July, and I don't think anyone played on them, but I think some people did. And I think we joined one, and there was like three people, and it was actually a lot of fun fucking with them. Funny. Man, I don't like joining like arena servers and deathmatch servers with just like two people or three people because yeah, then I demolish them and they leave. But like, I mean, like also a thousand people are thinking the exact same way you are. Okay, I found I found the um, thing I was talking about. This this happens on full moons on the screen. That's that's amazing. Do we have a really? I uh, huh? I don't, I don't know if we have a good more questions actually. I don't. I don't. Um, uh, why did you remove the crab? Why did you remove the crab? Crab? The infected crab? The big crab? The big crab. The big um, crab. Okay. Um, Danaby has recently realized this on Twitter.com. He had a fucking like a fit about it, but like animals <laughs> in Unturned are actually like horrid. Yeah, they are a mess to set up. Like they are a nightmare. Uh, for a while in Easter Island's development, the boar just flew. <laughs> it just fly, and then it fixed it randomly. It just stopped flying. Um, and the horse, when you killed the horse, it would stand on its legs, but its neck would fold in on itself, and then it like contorted it into a ball that was vibrating and gyrating rapidly. Oh no! That sounds hot. And the turtle, if you shot it, and if you killed the turtle, damn, I would fuck a turtle. Uh, yeah, me too. But the um, the limbs on the turtle would start spinning, and then they would just fall off. How and... do they just fall off? Isn't it all one model? No. Oh. It's because of armature stuff. I don't know. It's like okay, ragdolls are weird, and it's like it's a bunch of simulating stuff. I don't know. I think ragdolls are cool, but they're weird. Um. Okay, but the the crab got removed because um, it would run at you backwards at Mach 10, and then it would clip inside you and deal half your health, and then um, you would die. And crabs look like shit in Unturned because inverse kinematics just not there. Like, their limbs are floating. So it looks like shit. Um, And... The issue, okay, and then you would kill the infected crab, and it would start spinning in the air, and it would start spinning upwards, and just, like, hooked on itself. I don't even know what the hell was happening. Um, Animals are a horror story. The animals in California, by the way, the scorpion, if you shoot it, um, the game crashes. Um, (laughs) That's funny. How do you kill the scorpion? And then your bullet stays suspended midair. And then the crab starts exploding into a fountain of leather, and it just starts spilling out of it. And um, and you can't shoot anymore. You can't move. Well, actually, you can move, but you can't shoot anymore. You can't switch off your weapon. You're just... Oh. That's kind of funny, actually. I remember this also happened to Frogger when he made a rat. I think I might have a, a, pic, a video of it. I think I showed it to you, though, Charles. Maybe. That was oh. a very long time ago. Uh, Wait, Charles, do you remember when you managed to start running and jumping while crawling? Yes, that was because you guys had a really bad beach chair. Yeah, I don't know what's up with that, because I showed it to Nelson, and Nelson's like, what? <laughs> Literally, me, I was like fucking around with, it was like my two uh, best good buddies when it comes to this shit. Uh, Code and uh, another person named Smiley. And we were just fucking around. I fucked around with this like bench, like this bench, and then this chair. And then like for whatever reason, the fucking chair made your character just stay in like crouched form, even if you stood up. So I was like going around, like, am I in snake form right now? 
and I was asking everyone and I t- like do this and they did it and I was like oh shit it's it's a thing that's able to be done and we just pulled up to uh you guys a little bit after yeah, it all snake and form I we all jumping all- around <laughs> he's just like lol and that was it <laughs> it was I just unturned man unturned that was some funny shit um I don't really know. I sent a video on chat, by the way. I, I know. I'm not playing it because Among Us. See? No, because we have a little bit of a like a tradition at the end of the episode to like just, like scream out someone's name and say fuck them. But like I don't, I don't know if you want to do that. That's when we haven't done it in two episodes. What do you mean we did not do it in both episodes? Oh wait, we did. All right, let me. Nah, we might not want to do that because then there's going to be a comment. That's just uh, your IP address, your address, your social fuck security you, number. Rider. That would that'll be, All that'll right. be the ending. Shout out to somebody on Earth. Yeah, somebody else on Earth. Um, at least part two, baby. Somebody else on Earth. Somebody, somebody else on Earth. You don't like somebody on Earth? No, I love somebody on Earth. I like We them. love oh, you, somebody actually, else on Earth. Okay. I have one story. I remember playing Car Pat with like Danaby or an Exxon Union, a whole bunch of other people. It was a large party. I barely knew anyone there. Uh, and I remember Union got a bus into a cave. Because there's like there's like this hut <laughs> in a cave in Car Pat. And he's like, we're getting inside that. And he, he we got on a bus and he started making it gyrate so much that it fucking clipped through the map. And we got shot into the this hut and we got inside it. But it was like the most I think there's footage of that. And then also, I think we clipped out of bounds in the dam because we found there was like a face missing in the dam. And Union also clipped us through there. and. I have a picture somewhere of somebody on Earth just floating in the air, swimming under the dam, and it's such a confusing photo. Union is like the OG glitcher. He was the first person to get the beret. Him and us. Him they, and us. They brutalized the game, dude. Literally, it was it was like it was crazy to think about. I, I was I was talking to Union about that shit. I'm like, what was the deal with uh, your first doing of that shit? And he's like, hey, he told me some interesting shit. I remember he told me like. The debugger beret wasn't even supposed to be a beret. It was supposed to be a spider cape, apparently, that had like actual like a uh, fluid movement. But like I, I don't. Oh. But like it never, it can never came to be. Which, if there was a spider cape that had fluid movement, I mean, I think a lot more people would be making fluid items in the game. From what I yeah, I mean, okay, I mean, like cloth physics are cool, but they're buggy and unturned. I don't know, uh, cloth physics. In Unity, or yeah, I don't know, they're all right. Well, um, uh, yeah. I guess this kind of conclude this episode of the podcast. We really got nothing else to say. I don't really think there's, there's anything else to say. Yeah, I kind of fucking I, I want to like, like, can you censor my name? Like, I, I <laughs> fuck you, <laughs> fuck you. I don't, don't want to be a. Hey, okay, can we get a? Um, not happening. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this concludes this episode nah, of the Unturned Podcast. Shut you know, the Unturned fuck up, Z Man. <laughs> Bye. Fuck Z Man! Hold up, hold up. Oh, have a great day. Day. Hold up, hold up. Before we end, oh. uh, go check out Spevy's work. I'm gonna put like a bunch of links in the description. Fuck. Wait, did I we even that. talk about Easter Island? Actually, you know what? Yes, You're... we did. No, you didn't shit talk it. Shit talk it. You said you would. I have never played it. I can't shit talk. Fuck <laughs> Easter Island. There, we'll say that. Bad. Fuck Easter Island. Right. Easter Island. Right. More like uh, Dick's go to my right. YouTube channel. Subscribe. Fuck you, Night Rider. Yeah. Fuck you. Subscribe to my Patreon. On man, I, man, this, this, man, this episode <laughs> sucks. <laughs> play Tower of Powers on Newground. That's something I'm proud of. Stas made music for it. It's kind of a banger. Dude, this uh, is this app sucked. I didn't say anything, so it's not going to do Shut up, z Shut up. All right. Yeah. So wait, can we talk about no? Um, fuck the episode's over. Fake the fake episode's fake over. Fake All right, goodbye everyone. Spabby. Goodbye. Spabby stop. Stop. Yeah, stop. Yeah, stop. Stop. Fucking stop. 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 Enough. Charles, just <laughs> stop <laughs> recording. No, stop fake raids. Recording. I can't stop fake recording. Raids. The fake raids. <laughs> P9 yeah. faces base raids. This guy. Z man, they're not fake. Z man, yeah, they're not, not fake. fake. Z-Man. Z-Man. They, they are hundred percent really, fake. I'm gonna make really a video about it. And I think I think there should be consequences. Yeah, that. we need to make a UCC on P9. I'm gonna re up I'm gonna re publicize P9's oh, hypocrisy. I found something on Carpet. I remember I shot down trees and there was a tree on a tree. Bro, yeah. dude, okay, whatever. Sucks. Whatever. Like, can we talk about no? Carpet? No. Carpet's actually a good <laughs> map because it tried. We're ending the episode. Carpet sucks. Oh, what do you mean Carpet it tried? tried? This map didn't even try. Okay, this map did not but, try. but for real now. Okay, for real now. 
Goodbye, everybody. Right, but for real, this E9 makes his base. Are you still recording? I thought you no. stopped recording. This, no. send, this, uh, send this podcast to P9 if you're still Goodbye. here. And uh, <laughs> have me exposed. I like the I like that jet. That jet looks sick. Oh, yeah. I put, like, I forget what skin oh, that is. But I, like, I know what it is. On, like, oh, my fucking God. That's, that looks cool. I wish there was more vehicle skins. Like, Goodbye, like, everyone. Of... I fucking hate Bye. this podcast. Right, make Bye. sure you guys send this to P9. Bye. He fakes his raids.